Hi everybody, it's Susie Day and welcome to my channel. I am Human Dick Cho and in today's very short video I want to introduce you about the greetings in the Kingdom of Cambodia. As you can imagine, the influence from the West to this country is also quite big. They just say hello or even don't say anything, but the traditional way is very polite, formal and nice way I would say. Watch yourself. They say, for example, to younger humans or to friends, they may just hear the hands, like here, just on the chest, and say, Sesede. More formal, Chomripsuwa. That's it. The second way, if you greet older than yourself, or you put your hands, your palm hands here, just under the chin, you can tip the chin, and you say, Chomripsuwa. Maybe you can say also, Sesede. It depends. And the third one, very formal one is for your parents, for your grandparents, or used here for children at school to their teacher. This is just by the nose. And they say also, so as you see, very easy. There is a very special one, but usually not used as a usual foreigner or even not for human living here around. It is for the king. As you can imagine, you don't see every day the king, but if you should do this, then use this. It's very difficult to make, but it's possible to learn. It's almost the same like in the Kingdom of Thai, the way this, there it is called, the way they have different styles also. But more in another video. How to say in general hello? There are also different ways. You can just say the ordinary hello, everybody understands this, or just suasede, this means also hello. More formal and polite is chomripsua. This is very polite. If you want to go further, you can say, if it is morning, you can say Sosede Apron or Chamlepsu Apron. So, different styles. But uh, it's not that important as a foreigner or here called Bara. Bara is the word for foreigner. As you maybe know in Thailand, this is called Bara. Bara comes usually from the French. When the French came to this country, they used this word. So officially means French, but now it is used for all farangs or barangs. Barangs for it. Hmm? Easy, easy. But back to the greetings. If you say goodbye, you can just say li hai or you can say chomrip la ilia. Chomrip lia. Hmm? It's also possible. But very fast, li hai. But always be polite. What is not used here is to call the name. It's not used here, it's not common to say hello Pete, hello Sue, it's not used. Huh? To just say Chomritsuwa or whatever. And don't ever touch a head from a human in Cambodia. It's absolutely not polite. Don't do this, it is like a part of holy. What you should do also is to show the underground from your feet there where you walk. Why? They think in their culture that the head is a very holy or the holiest part of the body and the feet, because you walk every day on it, are dirty. So don't show this, it's very unpolite. These are the main rules you should know, besides other which you will find out yourself if you are in holidays here or on a day trip or whatever. If this video was useful for you, press the like button, subscribe if you are not. Watch my other videos about living costs, about visa entry rules, about other Southeast Asia informations. And also, if you're interested in technical stuff in Southeast Asia, I will do this. Or if you are a trader, stock exchange, forex, crypto, I also will some videos, but very critical ones. So, have a very nice day. Lihai or Chomri Lihai. Bye bye.